Hello my friends, Friday evening as usual, 10 o'clock is coming and I'm starting this, I don't know how come I never, I can't organize myself earlier, I have to wait for the late hour. So all the best to everyone who is celebrating um, Chinese New Year and it's a tiger year. So we will see what this year will bring us. Well, I'm not doing prediction for the year. I'm doing the. I will be answering questions for my from you viewers that you are posting under the videos. So I will start. Frida is asking: Did the beauty queen really end her own life by jumping, or was she? Or was someone else involved? And when I closed my eyes, I saw a symbol of bottle. It's not regular bottle, it's iodine, iodine bottle. And because I have antique dealer, I, I have antique store, I knew that iodine, iodine was the common thing for women to commit a suicide in 1900s. They will drink the iodine so they will look pretty after they die. They will, the color of the skin will be yellowish orangey, like dun dun. So most women don't jump from the, if they jump, they jump to water. So the, the skin will be still preserved. So the face will be preserved, especially she was a beauty queen. This gives me kind of iffy feeling that maybe someone pushed her. You know, women usually don't shoot themselves. Even when they shoot, a lot of them will shoot so they wouldn't really commit a suicide that way. It's very rarely that woman will do, you know, damage to her beautiful face. And she was absolutely gorgeous. She was Miss of USA 2018. She was very accomplished as a lawyer. She had a master's degree as business administrator. Uh, so, uh, when I saw this iodonite bottle, I can tell you something about those bottles. The antique bottles, uh, they were three-dimensional. You can feel that skeleton under your fingers. On the back, they will have that kind of texture that you can feel it in the evening. Most old people were too poor to have the glasses, so they didn't see well. That was the law that time to protect people from being poisoned, that they will be touching that texture and they will know that something is poisoning inside the bottle. So this is a symbol to me. Be aware, don't do it, don't touch it. And because I saw this as an answer, I have a huge doubt that she was the one who she was very busy. Usually very active people are not suffering as much with depression because they can motivate themselves to be, you know, to force themselves to be above the moments of putting them down. Even when my mom died, the same day I was so glad that I have people for readings. I had three readings that afternoon and I thought how blessed I am because I don't have to feel about my pain. I can share uh, the time with people and think about their problems. So, you know, we, we try to always get away from depression. And that was something that I have big doubts because she was always so busy. There was no time for her to, but we, we might know more. And I will pull three cards to see 
about her if that was the, the case. Yeah, it doesn't... Hanging man, who knows, you know, but hanging it will be easier for her than, than uh, jumping. Someone was leaning on her and she thought that, oh, she was ready to start new relationship with someone else and some man was probably very jealous about her. Hopefully we will learn more. Hamo Monga, talking about the truckers' protest in Canada. Will the truckers' problem get solved in Canada? <coughs> and I have to tell you, I think it will get worse before it will get better. I see spikes on the road, so it's symbol of making the barriers, making this unable to go forward and those truckers wanted to negotiate no one from the Trudeau government is negotiating with them and no one uh, the, the O'Toole thought that he will be kind of this way that way and he was destroyed because of that so instead of Trudeau, they destroy Conservative Party. I don't know, I'm not, but I saw them waiting for, the, the table is ready for the party, for the negotiations, and to celebrate, and I just saw that as a symbol of kind of not, but that was a, of a week ago when I saw that. So they are really not able to move forward. No one is negotiating with them, and that's what they want. In Alberta and Saskatchewan, the, those provinces already abandoning the vaccination, that we wouldn't have to wear masks and blah, blah, blah. All the restrictions will be taken away. I don't know if that's what most people want because we want to feel secure. I don't want my husband to, to feel sick or I don't want to be sick to, to get him uh, illness. So I'm still fine with the masks, the restriction of, you know, but that's what our, pri uh, our pri uh, premier of Alberta is trying to do, Kenny, and we will see how that will work. Does the uh, position want to do, uh, does the opposition, Kamal Monga is asking, does the opposition want Trudeau to resign? And I saw a sword and two people like us harassing about the sword. Yes, they do. That's that's actually the goal, and I think Otto went kind of victim, and he he lost his position. So the Conservative Party was out. Liberal Party is still in, but they are not negotiating. So they want the sort to. So do they want that to happen? Yes. That's behind the, all those drama, the devil. The, a lot of people are upset. A lot of people feel insecure. And they are fighting. So the, they are fighters. They want to fight. And Sandra, uh, please talk about Ottawa. So that's where those strikes are. Now they are moving to Toronto. And what do you see about trackers? So many people are asking that question. And I think it will actually move probably as well to, towards more USA. So in USA, you can be prepared for, for some waves of that. Roxanne M. Oh, 
she told me that I have to give her apology because I misunderstood her comment about Ukraine. Sorry, Roxanne, I didn't mean it to be. I thought that I, that's what I, well, I don't even remember the comment that I gave to you, so sorry. And I saw in previous video, lost or that Russia will try to make up the protect and now the all the news is are talking that they were trying to create pretext to to start some something in Ukraine. So two videos backwards or one I was talking about this and that's happened already. Kamal Manga again, will the Ukraine problem get solved by diplomatic talks? As an answer, I saw slot machine, you know, the, the one that you pull and it's the, the crystal ball kind of, a metal ball is going from one corner to another and then it's going in kind of hitting one place to another as long uh, how hard you can pull it and sometimes you can manoeuvre uh, to get to the center so I think they will be going this way that way direction so eventually they will hit the target I don't see the negotiation will be very successful I said that Putin and Xi are on vacation walking on the beach they are sitting by the table today and they were happy, you know, showing the world that they are on the same page. I don't think Putin will start anything in Ukraine until the end of the Olympic Games. He is not going to make any movement before that, but after both of the C and Putin will be doing this. Will the problem be solved without on diplomatic talks? No, there is not enough trust. The trust issue is huge. Ten, seven of swords. They will go different direction and the magician. Oh, hopefully that magician can pull the magic from the hat. So some, most of the time it's a great card, but not always because the magician can pull something out of the hat and we will be surprised and stunk and we wouldn't know what to, to think about. Christine Creely, can you look at the Ukraine children and civilians? Will many be hurt by the latest in interference from Russian soldiers? I see, I saw them being protected. So I, somehow I thought that they will be excluded from those uh, big battles. Maybe I'm too optimistic, but somehow I don't think they will be using them as a target. Yes, angel of security, they will be worn in advance maybe that that something will happen some places they will be playing roulette and the secrets we will learn later not as soon as we want it but later on if the video will be stopped please forgive me i will have to i don't know sometimes it stops and drives me nuts scott allen will whoopi Goldberg quit. The view gave her two weeks suspensions. And when I wanted to know the answer, I saw a cork being pushed under the water and popping out again. She will survive. She will be still capable of running the view. People love her. She has that wisdom, that sarcastic smartness she is absolutely adorable and she has that zesty so we know that she she was not uh, somehow it didn't work out the way she wanted uh, she said it and we all uh, when we are doing life things we make mistakes and that that's understandable yes she has still goals and plans 
she will be on the chariot in control of the situation and we will have fun and she will have fun uh, doing this because she loves what she is doing and she is very good what she is doing. Nine cats, nine cats, nine cats. We have been having storms and incredible high winds in the north of the country. The electricity is on and off, and the storms are often. Uh, another is uh, one is go out and another is coming. Would that be? Would that weather be permanent? Um, I think until we will be able to fix it, because as an answer, I saw Turkish attack on Poland in 1666 to 1672. They were attacking Polish soldiers, Poland, from different places, and they were like, Phew. you couldn't pro protect yourself, and eventually... Polish king was able to stop them in Austria uh, by Marysinka and Sobieski. I, <laughs> I was reading the book about uh, her, uh, his wife and him. She was the one who was wearing pants at home. He was big, biggest... Uh, one of the biggest fighters in Europe, but she had the <laughs> ability to control him. And he, Sobieski had to write her every day. Doesn't matter where the battle was. He had to write her a letter every day. She was so demanding. Ten kids they had, so many of them died. But she was such a super woman. She never let him to think about anyone else. Even he was a king and he was younger than her. Boy, she was the dictator in the bedroom. And when she had, she was pregnant, she was telling him, go for the war. <laughs> so that was a Polish queen. And that was, her name was Marysienka, which is married. Yes, we will have that problems with whether we will have to walk on the eggshells for a long, long time. Drama after drama, shaky tower damages, and eventually people will be starting, you know, paying more att attention to the weather. So I said that that will be a serious problem and it will have to be solved by every country. Jorlin Surbin Surdin. Is Quebec going to be successful in going uh, getting his independence from Canada? And if they do, will they be it will would they be better? Quebec is a province in Canada that speaks in French. The rest of Canadians are, speak, speak, are speaking English. I hardly can... I'm from Alberta. Hardly you can hear French once a year. But uh, all the politicians, they have to be able to speak French and English. Otherwise, they can't really be a politician. So that, that's the, the law that they have to be kind of bilinguish, bilinguish, and no, I don't think, think that they will be beneficial from the, uh, getting away from Canada. They try it. The security is so important, and, uh, you know, the, the country is, pr they are proud to be Canadian and we are proud to have them, negotiation, and the sun is shining on them when they are with, uh, with the rest of Canada, so I don't think that will be the best interest for Quebecans. Karen, I would like to know if non Huley become Ohio next government. And she's very successful democratic leader in Ohio, but I didn't see her being 
I saw her kind of cutting her hand by grabbing for something sharp, so I don't know if that will be, she will be able to, I will see what the cards are saying. Oh, crying over that broken relationship, it will be a really hard journey. Eventually she will fulfill her dreams, so maybe not this time, but maybe next time she's still very young. Lita Perma. <laughs> oh my gosh, I, I choose that one too. You are fabulous. You have rare fashion sense. I wonder if you have been a model. Okay, I tried once with my girlfriend. We were 17, brave enough to go for some uh, opening for models. And we just came in and the lady told me, you are too busty and not tall enough to my girlfriend. You are, your figure is fine, but your features are too sharp and you wouldn't be photogenic. So we both left. <laughs> We laugh, and I remember to this day that was a nice adventure for both of us. And I thought I knew that I don't have that, uh, you know, it, it was stick with the bumpers, as my friend called me once on his memoir. When actually, that was my husband's best buddy. When they met me they, on the beach, he said, We met Violetta, stick. <laughs> with big bumpers so I couldn't uh, yeah they are looking for for very slim flat chested and your assets sometimes are not your, not your assets because when the, once my doctor asked me if I would be if I would like to reduce my breasts and I said no that was my asset when I was young I'm not going to <laughs> let, that, let them go so I hope you understanding my jokes. And oh maybe one oh, okay. And for home remedies. This is from my father department. He was optim optometrist and optician. He was uh, studying in Germany after the war in Saisa school and he moved back to Poland. And he married my mom, but he moved because of his mother. She didn't want to go to Germany. And uh, so he, he was always telling me, wear the weakest glasses in the morning. Always have three pair of glasses. And the weakest were like, if you have one, two, the highest were the 150, 150 uh, 1.5 1. in the morning, 1.75 afternoon, and 2 in the evening when your eyes are tired. Don't wear the highest uh, prescription in the morning. Always start from the weakest to the uh, highest. That way you will be protecting your eyes. Uh, and my parents divorced when I was 12 so after that I just met my father once and that's it with his second wife and I was not very very keen because they were showing me the little baby and she was a few, uh, few months old and how beautiful she is she looks like you and I said uh-huh really <laughs> you know <laughs> so and his wife was from Germany so it was kind of, I was kind of jealous, probably. I was 16, I should knew more, but that was my last time that I have seen my father. But his remedies, I remember. So uh, if someone has, puff, that was the, the three things about uh, that I remember he said. And he said, if you will find out uh, when you are older that your eyes are getting weak, look at the green trees as much as you can just enjoy looking at the green color it will kind of rebuild your uh, rejuvenate your eyes i don't know if that's true or not but that's what i'm always trying and now i i have to wear in the evening number two glasses 
Okay, and uh, I know my mom, when she was going for parties, she will, buy, uh, she will put a cucumbers and uh, to, to kind of look better, you know, for the party. I, maybe a few times in my life, I put the cucumbers in, on my face, but usually don't have time to lay down and <laughs> put that mask, but it is very good. And if someone has the bags, put the tea bag from chamomile, oil, uh, chamomile tea, warm bags of the tea on your eyes and relax for 15-20 minutes if you can. And this will relax your eyes and the swollenness for under the eyes will disappear. But it can be any any tea. But the chamomile tea will be better because it wouldn't discolorate your, your skin. Okay? So now I would like to do the praying session. This is for wonderful husband that the lady that I had the reading yesterday with she, she is so much in love with him for, for so many years they, they spent 37 years together and uh, he is fighting with pancreatic cancer stage 4 and his name is Gerard Kale Cahill uh, is 57 and if we can send the magic of our energy towards him and help him to he is getting a little bit better with the treatment from with uh, chemo so we just want to boost his energy and let him to, to survive and anyone who is struggling with cancer we want anyone to profit with from that energy that we can send to people and let them to touch the magic we need that we all need to believe and we never know sometimes that helps so we want to to send the best wishes to maria and her husband and Everyone who is struggling with any any form of illness, imagine that you are under that warm bubble and protected and cured. Okay? Stay safe, stay positive, and see you next time. I hope this video will go through. <laughs> okay, bye-bye.